Okay, let's find out what's inside this Funko Pop. Let's go. How far can we get if we sell a little bit? Hi folks and welcome back to Funko UK Guy. So if you haven't been to my YouTube channel before, please remember to hit that subscribe button and hit that bell button so you get notified whenever I do new content. So today I'm going to be cutting open a Funko Pop to find out what they look like inside. And this is the Funko Pop I am going to be cutting open. Now this is the spare Carl Drogo I have got in my collection and I'm hopefully going to cut him down straight in the middle here and opening him up and finding out what he looks like inside. Now this is very dangerous folks, so I recommend you do not try this at home. And I repeat, do not try this at home. So let's get into my garden and let's cut him open. Let's go. Okay then folks, so I'm here in my garden. I've got the Carl Drogo here. I've got my circular saw and I'm hopefully gonna put the Carl Drogo just in the center here. And I'm gonna hold him in place by a bit of wood um, because I don't want him to slip and them to fly, and I want a clean cut in the middle, hopefully. So I'm gonna put them just here in the center, put a bit of wood just here, hoping it will stay in place. And hopefully I'm gonna do a clean cut straight through the middle of his body. So that's the Carl Drogo just here. And let's see what it looks like inside. Let's go. Okay then folks, I am ready to do this. Let's find out what's inside this Funko Pop. Let's go. Oh yes, okay. So let's find out where the hell is his body gone? Right, so I can't find the rest of his body. They flew off somewhere. But I've got half his head just here. It's a pretty clean cut actually, it's not the best, but this is what's inside a Funko Pop. It is hollow at the top here. It's cut near enough all the way down the body. So we've got some plastic all the way through. It's a solid piece of plastic, looks like. Um, this is the other side of his face, just here. And inside there is hollow. So it's pretty clean cut for the face. <laughs> his arm is literally ripped apart just here. Um, we've got a piece of plastic just there for you as well. And um, we've got one foot that's been cut in half. So his foot goes in just down there like that. And his head goes like that. And his arm like that. So it's not too bad of a cut actually. I'm really happy with this. So let's go upstairs and find out what it looks like a bit closer to up. Let's go. Okay, so I'm back in my room. And I want to show you what this Carl Drogo looks like in half. And what does it look like inside a Funko Pop. So it did a pretty clean cut actually straight through his body. It missed literally half of the bottom here. But hey, this is what half of Carl Drogo looks like. So it did literally fly off in about four or five different pieces. This is one side of his face. I've got his face just here, his other side of the face. Both hollow inside, and the heads. The um, body itself looks like it's a solid piece of plastic. And so we've got then the leg, which is just here, which flew off, which goes in just there. And we've got a piece of arm here. It goes just like that. And also we've got a little piece here I'm not quite sure where that came from. Um, I'm not too sure what that bit was, what flew off, but it did fly off the body. So this is what the inside of a Funko Pop looks like. I really hope you like this video, folks. Um, I had a lot of fun doing this video. 
And I might do another one in the future. But yeah, how cool does that look? At least you know what's inside a Funga Pop now. Like I said, I do not recommend you doing this at home, folks, uh, because it is dangerous. But I thought I'd do it for a video for you. So, thank you so much for watching. I hope you like it. And I hope you all have a good night. Bye-bye. How far can we get if we sell?